LNR celebrates the 55th anniversary of its founding, it is highlighted that radio remains the most important media channel for mobilizing all society to implement the party's strategies. Speaking at the gathering to mark the 55th anniversary of Lao National Radio, LNR Director General Si Panung Lat said, We can say that the previous Vitinyu Phai Patet Lao or Radio of Lao Country or today's Lao National Radio is a sharpened weapon of the party, a voice to spread the party's political directives. <laughs> He said, adding that Lao National Radio was also a party political organ, the spokesperson of the revolutionary organization, and a stage for raising the opinions of patriotic people throughout the country in agitating and mobilizing all forces in volunteering to join the battle for national liberation. In his remarks at the meeting, Minister of Information, Culture and Tourism, Professor Dr. Bo Senkambung Dala, praised radio civil servants for maintaining the outstanding traditions of Vitinyu Phai Patet Lao, saying they shouldered the burden of duty honorably in the fight for liberation, as well as over the past 40 years of national protection and development. He emphasized the carrying out of the party's renovation policy while pointing out the media's important role in contributing to the success of the mission through mobilizing all forces of social strata to join in. He noted that radio was the leading media channel in the role alongside oral propaganda. LNR was established on August 13, 1960 as the Radio of the Revolutionary Movement or Vitinyu Phai Patet Lao with its base in Veng Sai District, Wapan Province. The medium played an indispensable role in mobilizing people to join the revolutionary movement accompanying the coup d'etat group against aggressors and their puppet government. <laughs> Presently, there are 63 LNR stations throughout the country with 11 in the capital along with 19 provincial and 33 district stations which have signals that cover 90% of the country's territory.